Welcome to Mr. Mitsubishi. Thank you for tuning in. So much anticipated uh, vehicle is here. The Outlander 2023 PHEV is here and uh, it's very fun times to start to accessorize them as well. We have these uh, scuff plates or um, uh, door sills, however you want to call them, uh, that we're going to install today. It gives you a very good welcoming effect as soon as you open the door right there. In just, j instead of being just like, you know, black metal, nothing there, you actually have these Outlander scuff plates over there. So right now, today in this video, we'll install them ourselves. And if you want to order a set, you can head to mrmitsubishi.ca. It's my accessory website. You can place an order there and it's free shipping to most places. So um, I'll look after you when it comes to that part. So there we go. Right now, let's go and uh, install these cup plates. It looks like this. That's how uh, they're coming in a box, nicely packaged in with all bubble wrap so they don't scratch up or anything like that. Few things before we actually install them. Being that it's winter time right now, it depends on when you're gonna see the video, it might be the summer, but uh, you need to make sure that the vehicle is not too cold, not too warm. So we just took this vehicle out of showroom. Customer wanted us to install some uh, accessories, so that's why we're doing it. And um, the metal right now is the perfect uh, temperature, so it's not too hot, not too cold, so it's showroom temperature. And whenever you do your installs, if you do them in winter time, you gotta make sure you find a, a warm place like a garage or underg uh, underground uh, parking spot, or in uh, summertime is exactly the opposite. You wanna cool it off. You wanna bring in a shade, let it cool it off, and then you can install them. Otherwise, they won't stick right, and you might run into some issues down the road. The other thing, you gotta clean the surface, degrease it, and everything else, so I've done it. Uh, some people have asked me how I degrease it. I just use a glass cleaner, professional glass cleaner, gets rid of all the uh, you know, fingerprints, dirt, and uh, everything else what um, might be there. So it's prepped. The metal is the right temperature. Let's proceed to install part. So this is how it looks. It also has this nice protective uh, film on top of it, which we're going to remove after the install. But it says nicely Outlander right here. And when we flip it over each, scuff plate is marked this one is front left and this is exactly where we're going to install and it's quite easy so this one here is double-sided tape so we just uh, remove this tape here and we just stick it on the right place but before we do it we always always want to find the perfect uh, spot for it right so luckily it's fairly easy to do so we just follow this line right here that outlander has and we just install it exactly where we want it to be so now we have a little bit of flexibility here or there a little bit so we just find the perfect spot so it's in the middle and uh, it looks good and we install it properly so once we landed the, the perfect spot so there's few ways how you can do it either just kind of memorize it and put it where it was or put masking tape to a mask you know uh, uh, the, like kind of put like almost like pins right where it should be so I've done it quite a few times so right now I'm gonna just uh, take it off and uh, we are gonna put it back where it belongs. So it's a, uh, don't rush when you do it. So especially if you do it for the first time, take your time, no competition. Okay, now it's important to line up exactly the same way it was. Okay, right here, we happy with this. Follow the line. Okay, let's have a look right here. Okay. All right. There we go. We're going to put it right here. We can see where the line is. Oops, it slid a little bit. There we go. And we do the same thing right here. Okay, perfect. This is what we like. We press on it. And now we get to remove this protective film. Some people leave this film for a few months and then remove it. You can do however you want, but we can see how the uh, chrome lights up when we do it. Looks very, very nice, very easy install. And if we take a step back, we can see how big of a difference it is. As soon as we open the door right here, we can see this here pops right out. 
and it's quite simple. We do exactly the same thing for each and every door. So for the, uh, um, this, uh, the other side, right way, so we'll, we'll take this for the passenger door. We take this and follow exactly the same instruction, right? So we find the place where it has to go, line it up, and off we go. So there we go. We just installed beautiful uh, scuff plates for your Outlander. These, by the way, will fit on any Outlander, the new body style, the gas version and PHEV. So you don't need to worry about that. So if you order this for your gas or PHEV, you're fine. You're gonna be uh, good there. So there's no difference uh, in that regard. So thank you so much for uh, watching the video on how to install these uh, scuff plates. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you're gonna accessorize your PHEV. I love those accessories. This is one of the best vehicles I think out there that can be accessorized. Some cars you put something, it doesn't really look good. Outlander, I think the more you put quality good stuff on it, the better it looks. And plus it gives you a little bit of satisfaction with the fact that you did it yourself and uh, you can enjoy the end result so quickly. So thanks again for watching. You can head to mrmitsubishi.ca. It's my accessory website. You can order these things from there, free shipping to most places. Thanks again and talk to you soon.